Hi everyone, the Spider-Man here. Well, as the title says, uh, I have a rat pup here, and I'm going to be feeding it to my Scalopendra Gianti white legs. So I'm going to give it a nice large meal today. Uh, I don't really feed it many uh, rat pups, but I should feed it probably like one a month. That would be perfectly fine. So yeah, I bought this from my local uh, pet shop today, only 50 pence. So the gentleman in the pet store, he said, um, let it uh, defrost for about an hour, which I have done. And then he said after that, just put the bag in some warm water, which I'm going to do in the uh, sink. So yeah, the next part of the video will be uh, putting this little wrap up in the sink with some warm water. Just let it uh, defrost. I'll probably leave it in there probably for uh, three or four minutes. So yeah, so it's defrosted perfectly fine. So yeah, let's get started. So everyone, as you can see, I filled up the sink with warm water. And there's my wrap pup there. So let's just put the uh, wrap pup in the uh, sink. And hopefully that will defrost in the next uh, five minutes or so. So yeah, let's do a little time lapse. So everyone, there you go, little time lapse there, left it in there for about five minutes. So let's just shake off the excess water. And we've got a towel here and just, there we go, just dry all the uh, water off. So yeah, let's uh, get the centipede enclosure and uh, let's see if it's hungry. So everyone, while I'm here, I thought I'd just mention that when I got that wrap pup as well, uh, I bought some super worms as well, uh, only £2.20 for all of these, which is uh, fairly cheap. And I picked out the uh, the ones with the large Mario worms in there, the largest ones in there. So there's some big juicy ones in there. So tomorrow I'll be feeding my Egyptian predatory beetles tomorrow. So yeah, so please stay tuned uh, for that feeding video tomorrow. They've never had a uh, super worm before, so that's going to be interesting. So yeah, let's... Uh, Feed the centipede. So everyone, you're probably wondering why it's uh, dark inside the enclosure. Well, I started this video at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. And uh, after I uh, defrosted the rat pup, I came back into my room to feed the centipede. And it decides to burrow down in the substrate. And uh, now it's 10 to 12 at night. It's only just decided to come out, <laughs> you know, like 10, and 10 hours later, it just decides to come out. So, obviously the rat pups are completely defrosted now. So what I'm going to do is, guys, I'm going to uh, take the lid off and uh, let's see if it's hungry. So here goes everyone. There we go. So everyone, there you go. It's got its meal at last. And that's a huge meal for the centipede. Let's just uh, zoom in a little bit more for you guys. There we go. So yeah, like I said, it was uh, daylight when I started this video. And now it's... Uh, night time so not a good idea when the centipede decides to uh burrow for uh 10 hours <laughs> so yeah this is its very first rat pup i've tried to feed it pinkies and fluffs but hasn't really been that interested in it so yeah as you can see the centipede is uh very very large so yeah Let's try and uh, turn the enclosure around and get a closer uh, look. So everyone, there you go. Bit of a closer look. That's it eating its very, very large meal. Somebody mentioned, why don't you try and give it a, um, a chicken heart? 
you know, from the butchers. That's something a little bit, uh, a little bit different, or something I could consider in the future. So yeah, it will take a while for this to uh, be to be devoured. Uh, unfortunately, I can't do a time lapse because uh, I haven't got no light option. So, which is a bit of a shame. I'd like to do a time lapse. But yeah, you can see how large the meal is. It goes all the way, roughly, well, nearly to the uh, middle of the uh, centipede. But yeah, so shouldn't take too long for that to be devoured. Might take it probably a couple of hours, I'd say, but I'll be uh, fast asleep by then, everyone. And as you can see, it's uh, wasting no time eating its meal. Not a uh, pretty sight to see, but uh, it has to eat, I'm afraid. So, yeah. And uh, hopefully all this will all be devoured when I uh, wake up in the morning. So yeah, let's just try and get a little bit close. I can't get too close because I keep going out of focus. So yeah, I'll leave it to uh, enjoy its meal. And uh, thanks for watching everyone.